Episode 3! Hi guys, I just wanted to pop on really quick um, and talk about the vlog and the beach. So, I'm so sorry. I did not vlog the beach that much at all. I probably vlogged like the first day, just like a part of it though. I think it was just like us playing games outside on the balcony and that is it. That first day I got drink, drink, drunk and blackout like literally and then the next day i was just hung over did not feel good and then it was brandon's birthday and we went out to a steakhouse it was really nice and we were gonna go out after and i didn't want to bring my camera with me because i was scared that i would leave it somewhere and then the next day like when we were at like at the beach i did not want to bring my camera I'm, I'm so paranoid that someone was gonna take it when we were like in the ocean or like not by our chairs or I would lose it or sun would damage it some kind of way or sand like I don't know I was just very paranoid I just got this camera and I actually got it as a gift and I'm do not have the means to replace it right now if something were to happen to it so I was just very paranoid about that I'm so sorry that I didn't get the beach vlog content that I thought I was going to but yeah, I'm just I'm so sorry so just bear with me I'm gonna have a lot of good stuff coming out and I'm really excited so thank you and continue on with this vlog. Am I not even in public? No, it's like all oh, you you can't get shot. This is no, a true chase. I like how I do. Do you like playing chase? Yeah. I'm glad it's so fun. My family's going to do that. Oh, I hate mean, that shit all. It's from Florida. Yeah, Florida is live. She won't call me B. I should have said B. Wait, what? Wait, what? I don't call Blaine B. She calls me B. It's like, B. Yeah. Like Babe, that's really all I get. You yeah. call me Mac. Yeah. And Mac. Isn't Mac weird? Big old black. I called her Mac one time. And yeah, I like that. I think it's cute. Yeah, but he called me that in a text. Like, in an argument text. Oh, yes. Maybe one We were both upset with each other. No, he's like, come on, Tay. And I'm like, <laughs> man, you're my full government name. And I'm so screwed up. Exactly. That was really good. We're here playing games. For my birthday. I'll drink 12, dude. I'm not gonna feel shit. But no, these are four percent. These are less than four point two. Lame. Hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, I am. I'm coming back over there. Hey, Blaine Smith here. <laughs> Beautiful girlfriend right here, Mackenzie Tucell. Hi, Mackenzie Tucell. Say what's up. What up, what up? 26 for now. <laughs> y'all already see me in the vlog, y'all already know. Episode yeah, one he's two. fucking lame. First time, let's, let's flip the camera lame. back around so the ears don't flip. We ready, we're over this. <laughs> Mackenzie do y'all here. Mackenzie Lee. Episode three. Play episode up. three, it is episode three. here for just a second I want to do a Sephora haul real quick um, I picked up a couple things most of the stuff was to bring to the beach with me but it did not come in time it actually came like the evening that like we were like already left we went we left like in the morning and it came like that evening so it kind of sucks but still some good stuff that I can still use every day and I'm actually wearing some of the stuff today so I'm gonna start with um this i got the it cosmetics uh cc your skin is better color correcting full coverage cream it's anti-aging hydrating um serum and it's spf 50 and i wanted to use this because um you know like when you're at the beach 
like you know you're on the beach all day you go home you take a shower you're gonna go out for, for like dinner or something pretty casual and you don't really want to put like a full face of makeup on this is what i was going to use for that definitely with the spf because you know you're sitting on the beach all day um you know i still don't want to protect my skin and i got it in rich honey i got this sephora mask i thought this could be fun just to use like again like hydrating after sitting on the beach all day this mask it's just from sephora collection and it's a mask uh stick and it's watermelon and i got this because it was just on sale and basically it's just like a stick you just roll it up and put it on your um face for five minutes and then rinse it off i think it's like clay based and it says it has 15 uses and i think this was like 2.99 for the stick it was on sale it was this one and then like a charcoal one and i got this one because it was nourishing i thought this could be fun i don't know just to do all right moving on i picked up the like a small size of this fenty soft matte uh pro filter primer i was gonna pick up the hydrating one but it didn't have the best reviews like um depending on like reviews for my skin since i'm more oily it didn't have like the best reviews for girls or guys with oily skin so i just chose to do this one and i got a small size because i just wanted to try it out and yeah i hope it's good it's just instant retouch primer and it's soft matte and this is like a little box i hope it works out i don't know let me see if I can pick it up. Can't really see. Here we go. Um, okay. Moving on. I just picked up the Urban Decay All Nighter. I just needed a uh, like pretty like small setting spray that I could pack in my suitcase with me. And I just picked this one up because you know I've used it before and I liked it. And I didn't really want to try out anything new. Definitely if I was like, you know, I wanted to use, use something I already like liked or knew I liked for vacation. And I'm actually happy I got all this stuff because we are about to go to um, Brandon's cousin's wedding in about a week, I think. And I'm going to be bringing most of this stuff with me. All right, moving on. I picked up a travel size because I honestly didn't have any travel sizes of perfumes like that I kind of liked. So I picked up this travel size of Alien by Mugler. Mugler. And I know I like the scent. I actually don't have a big size of this, but I know I like it. So I just thought, yeah, I would wear it. And I think it goes good with summer. I mean, it's a nice scent. Um. All right, moving on to more makeup things. I also got um, the Fenty Cheeks Out Freestyle Cream Bronzer. I think this is relatively new. Her cream bronzers and then her cream blushes. I want to try them because I am a big fan and I usually like most of the Fenty products that come out. So I got this one and it's the um, Teddy shade in 05. And it just looks like this and it has a mirror. That's cute. And it's like good like size, you know, for the price. And then to go along with that, I picked up the Cheeks Out Freestyle Cream Blush also. And I got this in Summertime Wine and it's shade 08. And this one is a little smaller, which I guess makes sense for blush. But this is like the size comparison of them. And is such a pretty color all the colors with this was really pretty but yeah this is the color i think it's gonna look really good i guess i can swatch a little on my hand this is like the color Ooh, yeah it's pretty this is it on my hand obviously i wouldn't do that much on my cheek this would honestly be good for like an eyeshadow also but all the colors um for this first launch line were pretty good like i wanted to get multiple but i thought this was the one that would compliment me best for like every day that and then there was like a hot pink that i really wanted but i didn't get it all right moving on this was also a beach buy i got the um soul generio um 
like travel kit and it comes with the uh, um, Brazilian bum bum cream the uh, spray the Brazilian crush spray and the Brazilian for play moisturizing shower cream gel and I was actually really excited for this because this is one of my favorite scents and products I actually already have everything except for the spray and I was really excited to like use this like on the beach and, like just I have so many scents going on right now, but it's fine. But, like, this is going to be nice for just, like, every day, just on the go. You know, you don't really want to put anything too heavy on. That'd be nice. Or, like, nights out. Like, you just want to, like, you know, on a summer breeze. I don't know. But, you know. All right. I also decided to pick up the um, Sephora Favorites, like, little gift bags thing. Just because I thought I would like most of the products in here. And it came with 15% um, off coupons for all the items in here full, for their full size versions. So I thought that was really cool. So I can literally get 15% off of everything in here for like the full size version. So I thought that was like a bang for your buck. And this was actually a really good price. Usually they're kind of like eh, iffy. But it was a good price for all the stuff I got. So I'm going to show you all what I got. I have the names here. So the first thing I got that I already tried was the Living Proof Restore Hair Mask. It's Restore and Repair Hair Treatment. And let me tell you, I've used this once, but I already know I'm going to buy the full size version. Like, give me the biggest version. It made, like, my hair was so dry that, like, I was, like, thinking about, like, cutting it because it was so dry. But I used this once, and, like, my hair feels like nourished and like just moisturized and it's crazy just once and i left it in for five ten minutes and that was it so i'm definitely getting that one um yeah that was a good find next we got the nars lipstick in Tolede, and it's number 2913d i'm actually wearing that right now um with um like a brown like lip gloss over it kind of like a brown tinted lip gloss over it but i really do like it i thought it was gonna be a little bit white for my lips but actually it worked out so it's the color and it's really pretty actually and it's perfect again for every day next i got the Kale and Green Tea Spinach Vitamins Superfood Cleanser. It's a face wash from Youth of the People or Youth to the People. And I haven't tried this one out yet. I'm kind of excited to try it out. It smells really good. This is something I'll definitely travel with, I feel. And I think it's a pretty gentle cleanser. It's free of parabens, sulfates, um, PEGs, mineral oil, silicones, artificial colors. It's 100% vegan, um, and it's made from cold pressed extracts, and it's for all skin types. So I am excited to try this out. All right. Next is the Laneige Water Bank Moisture Cream. I've used this before. I actually don't have um, a full size with me right now. I think I used it up, but I like it. Um, it's just kind of like. You know, a moisturizer I don't know why I smelled it but yeah it's just like a normal moisturizer um nothing too special I guess but I mean this is nice to have again for traveling definitely for plane rides and stuff and it's for normal to dry skin and right now this is actually perfect right now I usually don't have dry, dry skin I usually have like combination oily normal maybe some dry patches right now my whole face is freaking dry um after being in the sun like my face just like totally just dried out and i'm trying to figure it out right now all right next i got a small size of this nude stick nudies and this is i don't even think they have a color oh zero one bo is that the color i really don't know but it just says nude stick nudies all over face bronze color contour multi-usage 
Oh, this is like a contour and like a blush, I guess. I thought this was like for your lips, honestly. I feel like I would use this for my lips because the color, huh, I'll show you guys. Color is kind of light for me. I can't really see, it's next to, it's right here. It's this swatch. I feel like this is a bit light for me. I think this could work for a blush and maybe like an eyeshadow, but I was gonna use it for my lips maybe. That's interesting, I've never seen that before. Nude stip, okay. And let me see. Oh, it says Nude Stick Nudies Matte Blush and Bronze in Sunkissed. So this color is Sunkissed. Okay. I'll try that and get back to you guys with that because it might not work out, but it's still really pretty and it's cool. All right, so next is the Victor and Ralph Flower Bomb. I feel like everybody's pretty much smelled this scent. I'm sure. I'm sure there's like just the basic perfume. Because I've seen this, yeah. Flower bomb first, first perfume by them. And it's just a little travel size baby. And this is good to bring too. So you don't have to bring like again like a, yeah it smells really good, a large size. So I think that is it. Um, yeah that's basically it. I do also want to say that I am wearing the It's Cosmetics CC Cream right now and I really really like it. This is a good option for if you're doing like a, um, like every day just don't want to put a full make full face of makeup on and actually it covers really well i didn't put any concealer on and i think it covers pretty good yeah i think it's pretty full coverage i do like it but i did put like a very sheer like layer on and it's still like evened everything out so i do like that and yeah i think that's everything as y'all can probably see i got um my eyelashes i got eyelash extensions before we went to the beach probably like um a week before we went and then obviously i had to go get them filled again after and if you did not know this sunscreen makes like your eyelash extensions come off because it um breaks down the adhesive i didn't know that and of course my dumb ass spraying sunscreen all over my face and i'm like why are my eyelashes falling out like they never fall out this early and then when i went to my eyelash girl she was like oh yeah they fall out and um, they're gonna fall out really quick with that and you should just like You can still put on your face. Just watch your eyes and I'm like, okay, cool But yeah, she went like a lot thicker this time but shorter which I liked because as they fall out It's still gonna look fuller than like before I had like um less volume but like more length and When like even like a couple fall out like you could tell like I had to get a feel so I think this will last longer which is good because I have that wedding again in a week so yeah no. um so yeah that is basically it I'm gonna end this haul right now um so yeah that's it so bye see you guys later